Hey, hey, hey. Welcome to Chasing as a Social Scientist by Mouth Daily. Pill number 868. You might be wondering what the show is about. People often wonder what the show is about. The premise is deceptively simple. I take my HIV medication live on the book of face each day in front of friends, family, and strangers. I do so in order to embrace stigma, dispel ignorance, and to find support after 868 pills, 868 shows, a number of bells, whistles, and bows. There is nothing around to about this show. The bells, bows, and other people. The people that come back night after night and give me their most valuable resource. Their time. To me, that's the most significant thing that's risen up and around and about the show, the community. Therein lies the support that I was looking for. But a number of bells, whistles, and bows have risen up and around and about the show. Ding dong bell, oh boy do she know the hell. I mean, the heck. This show has it all. I like to say that it is Cloud Atlas and that it incorporates at least 600 years of entertainment with Edward R. Murrow's radio broadcasts on record and cylinders played in a 19th century Edison home phonograph along with a nursery rhyme book from my childhood containing woodcut illustrations from the 15th century. It is, in a sense, also The Matrix in a previous iteration of this show I created something I call the Rainbow Tunnel, in which I harness the power of Grey Skull and the Eye of Thundera, funneling them through a series of warp nays, elves creating a static warp bubble, and a subsequent singularity punching a hole through the fourth wall across the multiverse and into the source. The show now takes place in an echo chamber created by me that serves as a way station to our reality and the source. I don't expect lay people to fully understand as this is advanced social science. Yes, yeah, so the show is also like an old timey variety show. Carol Brett style, mixed with a merry melody of Looney Tunes and a measure of Mark and Mindy, a dash of Mr. Ed and two two doses of Alice in Wonderland, a helping of Hee Haw, heaps of Benny Hill, the hint of the Highlander, tons of the Twilight Zone, tincture of Teen Wolf. Oh, 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 oh. In the homes of Oz, a couple of creep show and casts away, a quarter of Quantum Leap and a gallon of Gilligan's Island, it's a former show, a four minute tour. How was the previous play? I love Pinchy Pinchy Pen. Pound of Popeye. I am what I am. A whole block of Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood and a ration of the Rocky Horror Picture Show. I'm just a sweet transvestite. I'm transsexual. Transylvania. <laughs> Come up to the lab. See what's on the slab. I can see you. With anticipation, to t- t- touch me. I want to be dirty. Thrill me. Chill me. Fall up. Fill me. Creature of the night. An undone Benjamin Button. A corny ear of Dumbo. A college try of I spy. A couple of raw strokes of Bob Ross. A spoon full of Mary Poppins in the full. Monty. Python. Finally lumping Rick and Morty with a leader, a leader, a leader of I Love Lucy in the sky with diamonds and wham bam. Thank you, ma'am. You got the show. Everything is out of place and out of time here, including especially me. Alice will always be pregnant. Harambe will always be ready for her high fives. The first on the second coming will always be risen. With the Obamas getting blowjobs from the Woodies, the Supermen, and their boners will always be spinsters and sumptresses working the sweatshop, the twin twin towers. Will always stand with Lady Liberty. You will have their MTV. Pigs will fly. Disco and dance will rain. Like men did in the days of old. I write nightly the future history of anachronism for your future children and your elderly grandparents. May they enjoy it now in time memorial. If I'd have people take only one thing away from this show, it would be the knowledge that HIV is preventable. 
If you're HIV negative, there's a once a day pill you can take. They call it PrEP pre-exposure protocol, the pill is Truvada. And if you're HIV negative, you take it once a day and it works like a highly effective chemical condom. It prevents HIV. But if you're already HIV positive like me, treatment is prevention. By taking my medication every day and maintaining an undetectable viral load, it makes it so I'm not contagious. You equals you. Undetectable equals untransmissible. You could fuck me bareback all day long and never catch HIV from me. It's a brave new world. The future is now. And it's 1969. Free love. Woo. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Pill number 868. Down the hatch. We are robot. Ah, 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 ah. Pill 868, down the hatch. All right, all right, all right, all right. So, tomorrow night, I think we'll have a, a longer special travel edition of Jason as a social scientist. Um, special edition, we'll see. <laughs> and then, um, let's see, what else? Uh, I, I got sick. I think it was in the sun too long today. You know, I didn't get a sunburn, right? <laughs> anyway, Sean, I, I love that. I'll take your pills, everybody. <laughs> the ones that are good for you. All right, all right. Or the ones that are fun. I don't care which. All right, all right. I love you all. Mm -hmm. All right. Tomorrow we'll be around for communion tomorrow night too. All right, all right. I love you. Mm -hmm. Oh, that chip is really bothering me. Look at that. Next week I'm gonna get it fixed. All right, I love you. Mwah.